Welcome to ActNotes Tutorials, my name is Professor Bert, and I am going to give you a quick tutorial on measures of effectiveness. What are measures of effectiveness? Measures of effectiveness, or what I call MOE, are measures designed to correspond to the accomplishment of mission objectives and the achievement of desired results. They quantify the results to be obtained by a system and may be expressed as probabilities that the system will perform as required. The definition by Smith and Clark states, a measure of effectiveness is a measure of the ability of a system to meet its specified needs, or requirements, from a particular viewpoint. This measure may be quantitative or qualitative and it allows comparable systems to be ranked. These effectiveness measures are defined in the problem space. Implicit in the meeting of problem requirements is that threshold values must be exceeded. In the defense acquisition process, the capability-based assessment defines the measures of effectiveness and articulates them into the, the initial capabilities document and capabilities development document. Measures of effectiveness may be further decomposed into measures of performance and measures of suitability which we will address later in this tutorial. What are the characteristics of a measure of effectiveness? The following is a list of characteristics they can have. Relates to performance. Objective. Simple to state. Testable. Complete. Clear. States any time dependency. States any environmental conditions. Can be measured quantitatively, if required, may be measured statistically or as a probability. Easy to measure. Write as statements, not questions. And finally, maximize clarity. When developing measures of effectiveness, Creating clear and appropriate indicators to inform an evaluation is the goal. A measure of effectiveness could be expressed into five elements. Short title, the name. Definition, a clear description of what is measuring. Unit of measure, may be quantifiable or qualitative. Benchmark, a value that would define the desired state in terms of the particular aspect of the operational environment being measured. And finally, formula, an expression of how changes in the value affect the measure of effectiveness i.e., is more or less better? What are the best practices for developing measures of effectiveness? Measures of effectiveness should use assessment indicators that are relevant, measurable, responsive, and resource so there is no false impression of task or objective accomplishment. They should be easily understood and evaluated. Complicated measures of effectiveness are more difficult to evaluate and can lead to confusion and a lack of understanding of the real issue. A mix of quantitative and qualitative indicators is used to evaluate them to mitigate the risk of misinterpretation and overcome the limits of raw data in understanding complex situations. Measures of effectiveness can be broken down into measures of performance and measures of suitability. Several measures of performance and or measures of suitability may be related to the achievement of a particular measure of effectiveness. A measure of performance is a measure of a system's performance expressed as speed payload, range, time on station, frequency, or other distinctly quantifiable performance features. The definition from the Joint Center for International Security Force Assistance Planning Guidance states, Measures of performance are necessary for correlation to specific measures of effectiveness in order to determine the optimal levels of effort for objective achievement. A careful analysis of the relationship between MOPS and MOS reveals the need to shift courses of action if the current plan is inefficient, or have adverse effects. Measures of Suitability MOS. A measure of an item's ability to be supported in its intended operational environment. MOS is typically related to readiness or operational availability and, hence, reliability, maintainability, and the item's support structure. Several MOSs and or measures of performance may be related to the achievement of a particular measure of effectiveness. Thank you for watching this tutorial on measures of effectiveness. Please visit the webpage for more information. Congratulations on finishing this tutorial and thanks for visiting ACT Notes.